Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. My name is Brittany of BrittanyJJones.com and this is the fifth video in the Sew in 30 series for Simplicity 8550 View C. I'm really loving the way that this top is coming together. We are down to the last three steps right now and that is to finish our hem. And then we're going to finish off the facing with some top stitching and then do our buttons and buttonholes and then we will have a cute summer and spring top. So I cannot wait to finish this. Um, if you missed any of the other videos, just check them out and then you can see exactly how much I was able to get done in 30 minutes. Um, I will tell you right now, like the last four videos, I'm wearing the same shirt. <laughs> I had a really good day uh, today. I was able to sew a little bit in the morning and I had about two hours, maybe an hour and a half of time before my children came home. Um, so I'm just trying to, you know, use my time wisely to get my top complete. I'm gonna go ahead and grab my phone. It's now 2.46, April 6th. Go ahead and get my timer. All right, we're rocking. So now I'm gonna go ahead and sew my hem. So I just did the top stitching on the facing, the hem is done. So our next step is the buttons and buttonholes. And I already have my buttonholes marked. And I like to do my buttonholes first and then line them up. <laughs> and then line them up and then mark between the buttonhole where my button goes and then attach my button that way. So now I'm gonna go ahead and sew my buttons, sew, sew my buttonholes in place now. I have all the buttonholes done, so now I'm just gonna open them up very carefully. All right, so now the buttonholes are all done. I'm gonna go ahead and clip off the wool strings. I'm sorry, I have to cut strings as I go. Um, <laughs> but now I'm just going to lay this over, lay this side over, and the buttonhole side over. Line them up and pin at the top. So again, this is all I did. Lay that over so now I can go between the buttonholes and mark where my button's going. All right, so now I can go put my buttons on and I'm gonna be using um, these clear little half inch buttons. Probably can't see them, but I'm gonna be using these. All right, y'all, so I just finished sewing on the last button and our top is now complete. All we have to do now is tie um, the backs of our buttons in a knot to lock them in place and cut off our loose strings and that is it. All right, y'all, so that is it. Just gonna keep cleaning up the top here, cutting off all the any loose threads. <gasps> That's time. Wait, let me get the last thread. All right, y'all, so that is it. 316, we are done. All right, y'all, so our top is now complete. We go ahead and button it up right quick. And as you can see, it took me five 30 minute sections, segments. Um, to get this top complete. So if you start on a Monday, then by Friday, the end of the week, you will have you a finished top and that is awesome. Um, it's not all about having a whole lot of time set aside to sew. Just use what you have. I just showed you in five 30 minute videos that I started and completed this top and you can too. So I'm just buttoning it up. I have a lot of markings on here. I'm gonna um, wash them off and then I may even put it in the wash. <clears throat> here are our ties. 
such a cute little top for spring and summer. I'm so happy with it. So here's our top, y'all, that we just made. How cute is this, right? I love these sleeves. So thank y'all so much for joining me for our first Sew in 30. If you have any questions or if you have any suggestions, definitely leave them for me below. Be sure to follow me on Instagram because on Instagram, I think I'll start maybe like on a Friday asking you all to pick which pattern you like me to sew next. So definitely follow me on Instagram at Brittany J. Jones so you can keep up and, um, you know, take part in what we're sewing because I am just really trying to inspire you all to just use whatever time you have and not to get so overwhelmed with the pattern it's okay to break it up so what if you have to do three steps today and four steps tomorrow so what that does not matter just do you you know use what you have and just complete your project so again thank y'all so much for joining me for simplicity 8550 our very first sew in 30 series i'm really excited it took me five videos five 30 second 30 seconds <laughs> five 30 minute videos and we now have a finished top all right y'all so i will see you all in the next video blessings everyone bye